A little bit different format tonight in this video. We're going to be checking out the JC120 model in the GX700. There was a specific request to check that out. So I'm going to run the guitar in mono so that I can go back and add stereo effects like how I might do if I was using outboard gear in a recording. Just try something different. Um, so I've got a preset pulled up and I'm just going to like work through the menu and here's what it is right now. So we'll just go in here and click on preamp and uh, let's see what it says we have. Looks like the match list. We want that on. So we'll press it again and press uh, this guy here. There, now we can pick what kind it is. Clean twin, there we go, JC120. So now we've got the JC120 selected. And uh, let's turn the overdrive off so we can hear it. Now I think there's a JC120. Yeah, let me make sure it's on. All right, it's good. We're going to go over here to the cabinet and uh, see if we can find... There it is. There's a JC120 cabinet. So this should be as close as this thing gets to the JC120. So uh, let's turn these effects off. What do we have on here? Comp, uh, reverb, chorus, delay, modulation. We'll leave the, even take that off too, the noise suppressor. So that is our bare bones JC120 sound. Yeah. So there's our JC120 sound, and as you can see, I've gone back and used the GX700 as an outboard effects unit and put them on in stereo uh, over the mono guitar input that I used for the video. So that's just another way to use this thing. You can use it as a studio device or, or whatever, but the main point was to check out the JC120. So there it is. There's the JC120 model and the JC120 cab direct into my interface in my mono.